The Premier League of today released the new fixtures for the upcoming 24-25 season, the final season at Goodison Park. Everton are set to open a campaign at home to Brighton and Hove Albion and will end the season away at Newcastle United. Uh, Everton's final Premier League home game at Goodison Park, the last ever Premier League fix at Goodison Park, is against newly promoted Southampton. It's scheduled for Sunday the 18th of May. It may well change. Um, all of the games are on the Sunday due to the FA Cup final being played on Saturday the 17th of May. I put a little thing out this morning saying could the game potentially be on the Friday night to make that game on its own stand alone and, and to give the ground the send you know the send off it deserves. A lot of people have have agreed with me. Others have said, "What about the Sunday night?" We'll see. We'll see. It's whether or not you want to make it a, a standalone event. Otherwise, it'll just be amongst other Premier League fixes. I know it doesn't really matter. It's more to do with us. It's our own experiences of it, isn't it, really? But I think what the football club have done by requesting the final home game to not be the last game of the season is to try to make it an event rather than it just being a fixture. So we'll see. We'll see what happens with that, obviously. There we go. Um, the fixtures are out and are that, that's what we've been given. Brighton and Hove Albion on day one. It'll be a tough game. They're a good side. But Everton are a good side. Well, let's hope. We, we certainly finished the season well at Goodison Park, didn't we, with those five straight victories. Uh, Everton have apparently spoken to the agent of Borussia Dortmund defender Mats Hummels over a possible move to Goodison Park. The German is now a free agent after leaving Dortmund. Uh, he's got lots of interest from Serie A. Just imagine if we got Hummels, we'd have Seamus Coleman, Matt Hummels and Ashley Young could have the oldest defence uh, in the Premier League next season. We'll see. Um, in further transfer news for Everton, Everton have reportedly agreed a deal in the region of £10 million to sign Aston Villa midfielder Tim Irigbunam. He is 20 years old, uh, old, played nine times in the Premier League last season for Aston Villa, start one. Uh, he also spent the season before on loan at Queen's Park Rangers where he made 32 appearances and scored two goals. Very, very highly rated. He's been capped by England under 20 as well. So it uh, would be, well, it'd be a very positive signing for Everton, I think. Uh, Aston Villa encouraged to sell him because he's a homegrown you know, come through, be pure profit for them. We know that they are right up against the wire with their PSR um, and reports around Birmingham suggesting they don't really want to sell them, but it's a way to, to improve their financial position. Uh, and more on that, uh, word from Everton today suggests that their PSR hole is relatively small. Everton's preference would be to solve their problem, not by selling or dropping the asking price for key players such as Jared Brantwaite, uh, but through other means such as trading academy prospects. That's come from David Ornstein today, and that adds further weight to what we've just said uh, regarding the, being in negotiations with Aston Villa and what Aston Villa are trying to do, look for other ways to reduce that PSR gap. PSR stuff is absolute nonsense. Villa were, of course, one of the clubs that wanted to uh, extend... The, the losses from 105 million to 130 million, I think it was, got voted against it, which is a bit strange, but hey ho, there you go. Um, that is it for the News Daily. Make sure you check out the uh, all of the stuff that's on our channel. Just because Everton aren't playing games doesn't mean there's not lots of stuff for you to watch. Go and check it all out. Check the FIFA series. There's lots, lots there for you to go and view. Give the video a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't. See you later.